Dogs were at the state capitol today. It's part of a rally for a bill that would ban experiments on animals. The bill is named after a dog who died after being part of a Wayne State University experiment. News 10's Mars Anderson spoke with the organizers and researchers about the impact the bill would have on scientific research. This is Desi. He's joined here by his owner and a few other doggos in support of House Bill 4849, also known as Queenie's Law. This legislation would prohibit publicly funded institutions in our state from using dogs in experiments that cause them pain. Surely everyone can support that. And let me tell you, most people do. The bill's name comes from a dog named Queenie who died after being experimented on by Wayne State University. Ryan Merkley of the Physicians Committee for Responsible Science says taxpayer dollars have been funding experiments at the university for several years. What we see at Wayne State are dog experiments, these heart failure experiments that have gone on for more than 30 years. Hundreds of dogs have been killed. In a statement to News 10, Wayne State says in part, advances are made incrementally and often painstakingly over years. Wayne State University is committed to the responsible and ethical use of animals in research and also recognizes the benefit of research involving animals. However, the bill supporters say there are better alternatives to testing on dogs. George Washington University collects human relevant data using diseased hearts from patients undergoing transplants or hearts that have been donated to science. At the Mayo Clinic, researchers conduct heart failure studies with human patients. In Lansing, Mars Anderson, News 10. The FDA does not mandate the testing of human drugs on dogs. Locally, Michigan State University does not use any dogs in experiments that would be covered by this bill.